Hello kids, how are you? I hope you are fine. I'm Miss Amal and I'm teaching math for KG2. Today you will learn about greater than, less than, equal to. Have you heard about these words before? Greater than, less than, and equal to? Okay, let's learn about these words, but let's start with greater than. Greater than. Greater than. Oh, who is this? Do you know who is this? This is Mr. Alligator. Okay. Oh, what's wrong with Mr. Alligator? He is hungry. He wants to eat. Right? Okay. Do you know what does he like to eat? He likes to eat fish. Okay. Oh, he has two groups of fish. Let's count the group of fish, this group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so there is a group of twelve fish. What about the other group? How many fish in this group? One, two, three, four. So now we have two groups of fish. One group has 12 fish and the other group has 4 fish. Okay, Mr. Alligator is hungry and we, when he is hungry, he always wants to eat more. Okay, he is hungry so he wants to eat more. So, would he like to eat the group of 12 fish? or the group of only four fish? Yes, because he is hungry, he always wants more. So, he will eat the group of 12 fish. Can you see his mouth? His mouth faces the group of 12 fish, the greater group. Okay. Imagine that you have a group of eight fish and a group of three fish. And Mr. Alligator is hungry, so he would like to eat the group of eight fish or the group of only three fish. Yes, because he is hungry, he wants more, so he is going to eat the group of eight fish. Okay, imagine that this is Mr. Alligator's mouth. Okay, he will open his mouth towards the group that has more. Okay. How can we read this? We read this like 8 is greater than again, greater than greater than means that this number has more. Okay. It is greater than 3. One more time. 8 is greater than 3. Another example. 15 and 10. Okay. <clears throat> Mr. Alligator would like to eat 15 or 10. Which one is more? 15 or 10? Yes, of course. 15 is more than 10. So, Mr. Alligator's mouth will face 15 because 15 has more. We can read this like 15 is greater than 10. One more time, 15 is greater than 10. Another example, this is your turn, tell me. Which one is greater? <clears throat> 22 or 17? Which one has more? Of course, 22. So, Mr. Alligator's mouse will face 22, the number that has more. How can you read this? Your turn. 
Tell me, how can you read this? Excellent. 22 is greater than 17. <coughs> now, let's move to less than. Less than. And less than means that the group okay, has less numbers. They are not big. They are small and less. Okay, we have the same two groups of fish. Let's count them again. How many fish in this group? One, two, three, four. Okay, and the other group, do you remember how many fish in this group? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so now we have the same two groups of fish. One with four fish and the other one with twelve fish. Okay, Mr. Alligator is hungry. See his so he's going to eat the group of four fish or the group that has more fish yes he will open his mouth towards the group that has more fish he is not looking at the group that has less fish okay nine and twelve which one is greater which one has more nine or 12 yes 12 so mr alligator is going to eat the group of 12 but how can we read this this time we started with the smaller number because 9 is smaller than 12 Let, right so how can we read this we read this like 9 is less than less than 12 okay less than 9 is less than 12 another one 5 and 8 which one is greater yes 8 and how can we read this we start with the number that has less we start with the smaller number which is five so we are going to read this like five is less than eight five is less than eight twenty five and thirty three it's your turn to tell me which one is greater yes thirty three is greater than twenty five so, Mr. Alligator's mouth will face the number that has more, okay? And how can we read this? We started with a smaller number. So, we will say 25 is less than 33. Now, the last one equal 2. Equal 2. Okay, we have two groups of fish. Are they the same or different? Yes, they are the same. Each group has four fish, right? They are the same. So, four equals four. Equals mean that they are the same. <coughs> And the same means that there is no number has more. They are the same. 10 is the same as 10. So, we will read it like this. 10 is equal to 10. Again, this is equal to. And equal to means that they are the same. 10 is equal to 10. Another example. 37 and 37 which one has more and which one is less there is no one that has more because they are the same this is 37 and this is 37 so they are equal 
37 is, what is this? Yes, equal to. 37 is equal to 37. Okay, put, what is this? Do you remember what is this? This is greater than. Again, greater than. And less than, less than. And the last one is equal. Again, equal. Okay, put greater than, less than, or equal. Let's start with the first one. 23 and 32. 23 and 32. Which one is greater? 23 or 32? Yes. 32 is greater than 23. So, Mr. Alligator's mouse will look at number 32. And we can read it like 23 is more than or less than. Excellent. 23 is less than 32. Okay, this is number 67 and 55. Okay, which one is greater, 67 or 55? Excellent, 67 is greater than 55. So, Mr. Alligator's mouse will face 67, the one that has more. And we can read it like 67 is, tell me, greater than or less than? Yes, greater than because 67 has more. 67 is greater than 55. Tell me, this is number 89 and also 89. We have 89 and 89. Are they different or the same? Yes, they are the same. So, 89 is equal to 89. Again, 89 is equal to 89. The last one, 48, 48 and 79. 48 and 79. Which one is greater? Which one has more? 48 or 79? Yes, 79. And we're going to read it like 48 is less than 79. Again, 48 is less than 79. Okay, let's remember these symbols again. This is greater than, less than, and equal to. That was our lesson for today. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Bye.